Yeah, welcome to the program, the evening with Dan Aitman Hall. Got the timer. Good to see you. Good to see you. We have the songs uh, all picked out and uh, been praying about the program. And I hope it will be a blessing to you folks out there as you listen in. All right. And uh, let's get started with uh, song I'm playing the olive harp. And the song is called Take This Whole World But Give Me Jesus. Jesus, absolutely, yeah. yes. <laughs> all righty, we're going to uh, get all into the singing right now, and uh, we're going to call on Bob Better Have Faith, and until uh, she gets to the microphone, all right, Faith, are you ready? I'm ready, but I want to change. You know how a woman can change her mind? I'm going to read the scripture first. Okay. Psalms 34, 1 through 6. And I like this. David wrote this. I will bless the Lord at all times. His praise shall continue be in my mouth. My soul shall make her boast in the Lord, and humble shall hear thereof and be glad. O oh, magnify the Lord with me, and let us exalt his name together. I sought the Lord, and he heard me, and delivered me from all my fears. They looked up to him and were lightened, and their faces were not ashamed. This poor man cried, and the Lord heard him and saved him out of all his troubles. So when you seek the Lord, he maybe not stops all the trouble, but he can bring you through. There's a song out there that Cheryl sang so much that he'll take you through the promise and your trouble. Okay, I got a little feedback then. All right. It's when I prayed through. Yeah. I came to God one night in prayer with my heartaches and my cares. I prayed, dear Father, here I all I'm going through. And since I prayed and Jesus came, I have never been the same. I'm glad I stayed down on my knees till I prayed through.
Thank you, Pooh. Yes. Absolutely. And I'll never forget that evening up in Pennsylvania. On the second seat, I leaned my head on the first pew and cried out to the Lord to come and get me into my heart. I was five years old, but I started crying and a wonderful feeling came in. And I went up and told my mom, dad was preaching, there was an altar call. And um, I've said this before, I said, don't tell nobody, but I got saved. And you know my mom, she don't keep secrets when it's like that. <laughs> she said, Rhea Faith just got saved back there. Boy, well, they was praising the Lord. And I'm glad to tell it. But, you know, you're just five years old and you're a little bit bashful. But I've been trying to tell it ever since. Okay. In the valley, he restoreth my soul. Faith and love. Thank you. I was thinking when she was telling about being five years old. You know, that that was so real that it impressed a memory on her heart and soul that she remembered them well yet today. And uh, that's the way it works. That's the way it works. When you get saved, you're, you're just just something. Something, <laughs> this brand new in your, in your heart, you know. So, well, okay. All right. And what's your next one? Please? Okay, this is um, the blood of the lamb. I don't know if you remember, but it's three quarter time, B flat. B flat. And um, when you said that, that brought tears to my eyes, so I don't know how I'll get through this I'm already having trouble with sinus so I'm going to do my best looking down 
through the ages, God beheld the dying souls. Sin, it brought separation, nevermore man could hold. Oh, there must come down where blood alone redeems, bringing gifts to the Father of the souls made white and clean when he sees me he sees the blood of the lamb sees me as worthy and not as i am he sees me in garments as white as the snow for the He sees the blood of the Lamb, sees me as worthy and not as I am. He sees me in garments as white as the snow, for the Lamb of God is worthy and he washed me, this I know. All right, thank you, Faith. Good job, good job. All right, uh, we'll play another instrumental. Have Marcia come up here and uh, let me uh, to let the lower lights be burning, and then we have more singing after this. <laughs>
people song. Let the lower lights be early. All right, that's Marcia. Okay, let's go back and uh, more singing right now. I'm going to call on Linda. Linda, how you doing? Doing great, doing great. Doing Except great. for all this sinus. Well, seems like that stuff's always around. Yeah, it's it's been really bad though this winter, yeah. and don't seem to be going to be any better this spring or summer. Yeah. All right. Hell, yeah, what have you got to sing for? I'm gonna sing a child of the king. My father is rich in houses and lands. He holdeth the wealth of the world in his hands. Of rubies and diamonds, of silver and gold, his coffers are full. He has riches. You're blessed, doesn't it? <laughs> yep. I don't have a lot here on this earth, but someday I will. Amen. There's a song that I sing, one of these days I will, someday I will. Yeah. And it can't be too soon, really. Next one is, where will you be? <laughs> Just one life to live on earth. And it swiftly passes by From the moment of our birth Till the time has come to die God has given us this choice To decide our destiny In a million years Where will you be? Where will you be? Oh 
without my husband for almost three years now and I'm still waiting for him to come in the door but I know he's not going to but one of these days I will go in the door of heaven and hey, then I'll well. see him <laughs> then I'll see him go ahead and get blessed <clears throat> feel like testifying crying or something <laughs> all right I think I'm ready <laughs> <clears throat> that's what we've been praying for Sometimes I'm discouraged, my load's hard to bear, I feel myself stumble, neath my load of care, and I ask him this question. too that always touches people it's, it's it's just a feeling that we get that uh, you know you just can't uh, explain it okay I, I was thinking how the songs that we picked out today and I just opened up the scripture to chapter 34 of Psalms yeah. And every song relates to that particular verse and chapter that I read. 
that you call on Jesus and he'll take care of your fears and your trials. Absolutely. Yes. Uh, the Lord's with us today. The Spirit, praise God. All right, let's go to another song by Marcia. out in the country and take our shoes off <laughs> even before we're supposed to sometimes. So anyway, me and my brother Wade and the wife uh, Donna playing the organ. And now here's a nice little poem that always takes me back a few years entitled Bare Feet. <laughs> glad month of May. Don't you remember that wonderful day when off came your stockings and your shoes and you then were a barefooted youngster of eight, nine, or ten. And don't you remember how we used to tease and pester our mother to let us, oh please, take off her old stockings and old winter shoes until the day came when she could no longer refuse. Then with gay shouts of laughter and chortles of glee, in anticipation of what was to be, we'd yank off our stockings and jerk off our shoes, for there wasn't one moment that we wanted to lose. Then laughing and yelling, we'd dash through the door, our shoes where we dropped them on Mother's clean floor. Just wild to get out on the grass with our feet, in the shade of the maples, away from the heat. Now, I don't need to tell you how cooling it felt, or as we roll over it, how fragrant it smelled. Oh, there's nothing quite like it. I think you'll agree. Just to play on the grass neath the shade of a tree. To laugh and to holler, to tumble and roll. Why, even the memories brings back to my soul a feeling of laughter, a chuckle, and a pang. 
a longing and wishing to see the old gang. And don't you remember how tender your feet the first couple of times you tried crossing the street? You humped up your shoulders, you squeaked up your toes, you puckered your forehead and wrinkled your nose. But soon they were calloused and battered and tough from skipping and tripping over bumpity stuff. And when we even stubbed them and knocked off a nail, we scarcely would whimper or utter a wail. But oh boy, when we scrubbed them to get off the dirt, the bruises and the scratches and cuts used to hurt. And we didn't scrub them until we were told. And all but the water, it seemed cruelly cold. Just two tired little fellows, worn out with their play, along about bedtime at the end of the day. And now let us leave them in dreams that are sweet, as we too are dreaming of days of bare feet. I thank you, Wade. I mean, a lot of you folks uh, can relate to that. Remember when you maybe pull off your shoes and socks <laughs> and go barefoot. Oh, boy. All right. Now let's move on to some more music right now. I'm uh, going to play a song by my brother Harry and uh, yours truly. We together different instruments and uh, so let's call Harry and yours truly.
Oh, I thank you, uh, my brother Harry, and of course yours truly. All right, uh, I'm going to go back into the singing right now. I can get up here. Okay. This goes along with everything today. Yeah. So much to thank him for. We do have so much to thank him Absolutely. for. Absolutely. Absolutely. When I look around and see the good things he does for me. Well, you did pretty good on the ending there. That's oh, good. Okay. <laughs> I'll forgive you. <laughs> we have so much to thank you for. That's yes, cool. we do. Okay, so consider the lilies. Consider the lilies. That's in C. Consider the lilies. Okay. In C. All right. Consider the lilies, they don't toil nor spin, but there's not a king with more splendor. Full of love, he 
morning with you but he's not too busy to care about you we have a heavenly father above with us full of mercy and a heart full of But there's not a king with more splendor than them. Consider the sparrow, he don't plant nor sow. But he's fed by the master who watches him grow. We have a didn't know I was going to stop. But I want to say hi to Randy Schaefer, Linda Rhodes, Debbie Wallace, Bertie Badgett, my sister Charity, my brother Bill, and other ones that write uh, every once in a while on Facebook. But they are the ones that comment, and we appreciate it very, very much. Okay. Okay, Dan. I right, thank you, Faith. And then we're going to call next on Linda. I'll have her come back. And uh, a lot of good songs today and a good spirit of the Lord. Yeah. We always pray for this. Absolutely. You can't be, you can't be the, when you have the spirit with you in the, well, all right, uh, Linda. Yeah, I do now. Okay. Um, heaven came down. Oh, what a wonderful, wonderful day. Day I will never forget. After I'd wandered in darkness away.
Were you dumb? No, but that's fine. You what? <laughs> I said no, but that's fine. Oh, I love no, get the rest okay. of it. Get the rest of it. <laughs> now I've a hope that will surely endure yeah. after the passing of time. I have a future in heaven for sure. There in those mansions sublime. In the shelter of his arms, and that's where I have to always be because I spend so much time in my house alone talking and thinking and everything, but I know I'm not really alone. I know God is there with me yeah. because if he wasn't, I, could, I couldn't have made it this far. I mean, it's just every day I depend on him for everything. So, just listen to the words of this song. When my soul was disturbed with sorrow When my heart was burdened with sin Jesus opened his arms of mercy
Sean Madden on the electric guitar. I put a little bit of dobro in here along with Marshall. Those precious memories. This is a beautiful song called The King of Kings. Beautiful songs by Marcia, my favorite organ player. And we're just about out of time. I want to thank you folks for tuning in. I hope you enjoyed the good spirit of the Lord and the songs and the music we played for you. We'll catch you back this way the next time. Till then, bye bye.